Hello everyone, how is it going? Welcome back to another video on our new account series. So I think this should be day number 113. And uh, with that, let's begin the video. All right, guys, now let's see what we have over here. Yes, I have defeated one sub boss. So let's claim the rewards. Okay, all right, guys, so... Uh, let's begin with Arena. Alright guys, so if you're new to the channel and if you are watching this video for the first time, I would like to ask you to please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell notification for further updates on videos just like this. Alright guys, as you can see, I am on Invincible, not even on Untouchable. I'm a, I am one rank ahead of that. I am on Invincible, uh, which means that I've played a lot of fights. I played with four teams, you know. I played with four teams, including my Multiverse team, Kings team, Batum in the Drowned, and with the LOA team. So that is the reason I am over here. I'm on rank 92, though, you know, not under rank 50. Otherwise, I would have been on the spot of legendary. Uh, but anyways, you know, this progress has been very good compared to the previous one because I lost a lot of fights. I don't know why, uh, but I lost a lot of fights in my previous season in the arena. And uh, because of that, I was able to get only 400 gems. I ended up on Elite 4, not on Untouchable. So that was that was not good. But yeah, you know, this season has began, began with a bang. I have scored uh, 5 million plus points every day. Uh, you know, and as you can see, as a result, I have 10.6 uh, million points right now. And this gives uh, like a lot of confidence for the coming days as well. All right, guys, now let's jump into the arena store real quick and take a look what we can do. Okay, today we'll get this guy to 35 shards. And then after that, 435 shards. And then after that, five more shards will get our classic Superman to five stars. There we go. There we go. 435. All right, guys. Now, uh, okay, so I think in the coming days, I should be able to reach 20 million for sure if I don't lose a lot of fights. And that is the plan. You know, try to reach, uh, you know, untouchable, if not invincible, you know, but. Uh, yeah, I'm going to try to invent, try to reach Invincible as well. I could go for Invincible, you know. Uh, but let's see. Still got two days left. All right, guys. Now, let me just quickly refresh these operations over here. Let's see if we get some gems. I mean, we're getting a lot of coins, getting a lot of shards and gears. Uh, but yeah, you know, gems are something that are not coming out that often. As you saw. All right, guys, now let's jump into Champions Arena real quick. All right, guys, so I'm on rank 20, not bad. And uh, on rank uh, 20, actually, it gives me enough uh, breathing space, uh, you know. So, uh, you know, I'm going to play a few more fights today as well. You know, and I'm going to try to get somewhere around uh, rank, uh, I'm sorry, 120 points, maybe. Uh, five, six fights, uh, four or five fights at least with eight points should get me to uh, 120, somewhere around over here under rank 10. And then we'll see how things go. But yeah, the progress in Champions Arena on Division 5 is quite easy. I just hope that we get, I get some easy teams to fight with on Division 4 and I at least maintain that position. You know, because I've been up, I've been going up and down, you know, on Division 4, 5 and then 4 and then 5 again and then 4 again and then 5 again. So this has been a bit of uh, frustrating uh, events that have been happening, but I'm going to try my best uh, to reach Division 4 and then maintain my rank over there because that is very important, you know, to maintain the position. If not, then you get back, you're getting 1,000 gems again. So, you know, I think that is a bit irritating, but yeah, you know, I'm going to try my best and I'm going to try to reach uh, Division 4 and get and stay on Division 4 for a few weeks. All right, guys, now let's jump into solo raids, boss Shazam. As I said, guys, I will defeat boss Shazam. And uh, yeah, you know, I think if I use Zatanna, uh, Black Adam, uh, uh, King, obviously, and, uh, you know, do some percentage damage, then I think I could easily finish off boss Shazam. Yeah, there are some uh, issues that I might face with the hazards and stuff. So, uh, 
you know, I think Batum and the drone should be the last pip that I'm going to use uh, to defeat Boss Shazam. And uh, yeah, you know, I've already used up my three main uh, damage dealing teams over here. Uh, two teams to defeat two sub bosses and one to take down this much health. So uh, yeah, you know, Boss Shazam is a bit difficult for a new account, but technically he's not that difficult, you know, because I have John Stewart, Green Lantern, and Batum in the Drowned. So I'm going to use those team, use those characters, including Shazam, and I'm going to try to finish him off as quickly as I can, you know. And I think uh, my solo rate progress is definitely great uh, because, as I mentioned before, that I'm going to finish off at least tier three sub bosses. But I've also already finished the sub bosses. I've just I just have Shazam left. So yeah, this is definitely going to be uh, a really good progress, really good end to the solo raid, you know. And I think uh, when whenever the next solo raid comes in, it probably will be on ice, as people are saying. Uh, you know, if it's on ice, that is definitely great, you know, because I really need the Nora Snow Globe on this particular account. If I get Nora Snow Globe, it will be again a game changer with King, especially, uh, you know. So I think I should get Nora Snow Globe if uh, we have uh, on ice solo raid next. And uh, yeah, you know, this is definitely going in the right direction, the solo raid progress. All right, guys, now let's jump into the store real quick. I don't think that there is anything else. Oh, okay. We got the Batman Ninja team chest. Now, Batman Ninja team is not uh, worth it. I mean, I mean, if you need Grodd, then you can go for the other chest that we have, which includes uh, COW Superman and Grodd as well. I think something like that, which gives you around 5 to 6 per I think it gives you 8%, 5 or 8% chances for getting Batman Ninja Grodd. So that should be the right chest for you guys to go if you want Grodd. But Batman Ninja characters can be easily obtained uh, through uh, the arena except Grodd. So I think that should be a waste of your gems. Please do not open this chest. Okay. All right, guys. Now let's finally collect these activities, rewards. And jump into the roster. All right, 3.3 .3 million roster threat in almost four months, which is not bad. All right, so I will work a little bit on uh, the gears for Multiverse Armored Supergirl because I'm trying to get them all to level 40. I think level 40 is the right place. Okay. You know, it will take me some time before I put on the right stats on this particular character because all we need is attack, attack stats. And it's a bit difficult to get all attack stats at once. So yeah, this will be fun. And let's see if I can upgrade a little bit of her special one, just to give me some more time for burning. All right, guys. So uh, yeah, I guess that's about it for the video, guys. If you enjoyed it, give it a like and let's meet again in the next video. Until then, guys, you have a great day. Take care, be blessed, and stay safe. Have a good one, guys. Bye-bye.